YouTube, it's Joe Gash here, and today I'm going to tell you guys how to remove ads from your iPod. This removes ads from apps, ads from Cydia, ads from App Store, ads from Safari, ads from everywhere. So you're pretty much ad free. Yeah. Okay, so now um, I can't find a website that displays a lot of ads. I can't find a website that displays ads. I know it's stupid of me because when you're not looking for it, you find it. But when you try to actually look for it, you can. <laughs> but anyway, I know an app that does, and that would be Tap Tap. So I'm gonna go into my apps folder. Um, I can try Tap Tap Revenge too, but let's go on. Let's see what Tap Tap is. Let's see if that has ads. It probably does. Uh, this one doesn't display any ads. Um, but we go on to tap tap two. There's an ad. It says you have one new quiz challenge. Ads by AdMob. Now, we want to get rid of that. So, what we're going to want to do is SSH. And, um, yeah. So, there will be videos on how to do this on YouTube or Google. Press up three times. Go into our etc. file or ECT. And right here you'll see a file called Host. What you want to do is right click and rename. And you're going to want to name this host.bk. Okay, guys? Now go in the link in the description and download the host file that I provided and drag that right in here. And now look what you'll have. You'll have a host.bk and a host. Leave them both in here. Now, if this doesn't work, you might have to reboot your iPod, but my iPod doesn't need to be rebooted because it works on my iPod. I don't need to reboot. Um, so, launch tap tap. And if we just wait for this to load, we don't have any ads, guys. At the bottom, it will say tap tap dance, but this isn't considered an ad. This is pretty much on the app itself. If we click it, it doesn't take us to Safari. It takes us inside the app to another page. So we pretty much, it's not, it's not really a, it's not an ad. It's not an ad. It's part of the app. Okay? So, thanks for watching. Comment, range, subscribe, and have a nice day.